Today we're going to teach you knots that will help secure your load, secure yourself, and even build a ladder. You'll want to stick around. Welcome back to Outdoor Skills Made Easy. Today we're going to start by teaching you the figure eight knot. Figure eight is commonly used for climbing, sailing, something that you need to secure the end of the knot and not let it slip. Let me show you how that's done. So to start, we'll just make a loop in our rope. Remember that this is the standing end of the rope. This is the working end, or some people refer to this as the traveling end of the rope. So with our loop, we're going to make an overhand knot. And generally, we would just come up through the loop that we've made, and that's just an overhand. But we're going to continue around the loop that we've made, and then come through to create a perfect figure eight. And you can see that. This is a knot that is strong, it won't slip, and it will hold all the weight that the rope is rated for. Let's say that you're sailing and you need to tie a figure eight through an eye hook. And so to do that, you're just going to create the figure eight in your line without the loop in the end. And there it is. Then we'll go through or around our standing object. And the only thing you have to do then is follow the figure eight that you've already made. Down through. Follow it around. Back up through. Now we're going to follow this around. And come out down below, tighten it all up, and there you've got a perfect figure eight around a standing object. The next knot that we want to teach is called the Marlin Spike. It's an easy knot to do. It starts with a slip knot. Make your loop, just flip that over, and we're going to pull this through, put our dowel through there, tighten it up, and there you can see the Marlin Spike. Now you've got a tool that you can add some additional pressure on your rope or if it's attached to a load or something that you need to, to tighten up. So that's a great thing to have. In addition to just using that as a device to tighten up your line, you could actually use this knot to make a ladder. And let me show you what we've built here. So you can see we've got a Marlin spike knot and we've just looped it through different rungs, created a ladder. And so we could hang that up and uh, if you want to start with your rope over the top of a branch of a tree or whatever it is that you need to get up to, it's a great knot to be able to make something that will help you climb up. So there's the Marlin spike used to make a ladder. The Alpine butterfly is simply a knot in the middle of a rope that will not slip. Let me show you how to make that. Let's start by making three lines on your hand. And the center line is actually going to be the loop. So I'm going to pull that out just a little bit so that you can follow it. And what's going to happen is this loop is going to go under the third line, all the way around and out. So here we go. Under the third line, all the way around, and back out and I'm going to snag with my finger just so that you can see that's the loop that we've made and we're just going to tighten up both ends and there you have a perfect alpine butterfly. These knots are easy to do, they're fun to learn and they're really easy to master and you know once you do you'll be amazed at how many times you'll be using them. We hope that you'll try it and we hope that you'll join us again at OSME TV.